morning everyone i hope you are fine and good at your home and enjoy the holidays okay okay let's move to the next lesson but before we going to move another lesson so we have to look at the day and the date and the year okay so today is friday 3rd april 2020 and you know the next month it has coming so the next month is april so we have to repeat friday 3rd april 2020 okay as you know the course book is grammar friends 2 and the unit number 3 and the lesson outdoor twice and you know the page number 16 and this is review of can for ability okay as you know we are moving forward to use the can or can't okay use of can or can't and make sentences we already made the sentences and then we have the uh, two options to select the right right one so uh, we tick the right right picture and right right answer okay so we have the sentences simple sentence negative and interrogative okay so in this board we have the we have to use the can or can't by see the tick and cross okay so here is the as you know this is the tick so it means can and the, this is cross it means can't we can't and the tick is another tick for skating so we have the tick so it means we can okay so we use here we dash play skateboard skateboard have the tick so we have we use here can okay and for the tennis is cross so we use we can't because we don't have ability to do the to play the tennis so we use here we can't play tennis and the second one is they can cannot play tennis oh so we use here can't okay and this the, the one sentence have the two parts so here the first part tell us that they can't play tennis the second part of the sentence tell us that they can play skateboard you see the tick so we use the can okay easy for you okay the third one is she can skate because we see the tick here so we use can the second part of this sentence tell us she can't skate board this one is skate and she can she can skateboard also so she has two two ability to do the skate and skateboard okay so this one is your homework the homework is about to review 
your all the unit and you have to do the same thing like you have to make the at least 20 or uh, at least um, 20 or 15 sentences to make the to use the can or can't okay so in if this is your homework you just have to review okay because this chapter is most important for you so you, you can show your ability or you you can't show your ability when you don't know how to do it okay so this is our uh, whole whole chapter review okay and mostly we we do the this chapter mostly time okay so i hope you are learning and take interest in this chapter in this unit and i hope you will do the homework as i give you already okay and the other homework you can ask your parents to uh, take from the uh, from this school and then you can do at your home and then give you give us back okay so this is our lesson and i hope you will enjoy to do at your home okay it's time to say goodbye and see you again okay